Welcome to the Kavo OP3D Hardware and Software Overview video. This video will help to familiarize you with the system before acquiring an image. Areas to familiarize yourself with on the OP3D are the power switch, the rotating unit, the patient positioning panel, the head support, head support locking lever, emergency stop switch, patient handles, positioning lasers, patient chin rest, status indicator light, and the exposure trigger. The patient positioning panel includes touch-sensitive controls for raising and lowering the carriage, a test mode button that disables radiation production, the patient positioning lights button, the exposure indicator that illuminates yellow when the device is radiating, the ready indicator that illuminates green when the device is ready for imaging, and a status indicator that will illuminate blue when the device is in an error state. The home button drives the unit to the home or patient in position and wakes the device from power saving mode. Within the OP3D graphical user interface, you will find two image modality selections, Panor 3D, the image program settings, the main view area that displays a dental chart for the selected modality, the status message bar, image parameters, exposure time and DAP, a sample image of the selected program or 3D field of view size and location, a patient size selector, test indicator, and an end study button. There are four types of panoramic imaging programs, standard panoramic, pediatric panoramic, bite wing, TMJ, and TMJ lateral. With the 3D imaging program selected, you can select the region of interest for the 3D scan. This will automatically change the field of view according to your selection. The field of view size display and selector, the image resolution selector, and the scout image program. Thank you for watching. For more information, please visit cavo.com.